Hello everyone. I am back with my uh, Camille Rose Naturals Almond J Twisting Butter. I finally decided to give this product a try. It took me over a year, two, three years thinking about trying this. Watching all the reviews, everybody said this product is $16. When I went to pick it up from Target, it was actually $16.99 or something. So that's $17. And by the time I finished paying for the tax and everything, it came to a total of $18.18. .18. And it said 8 ounces. But this is one of these packaging that I call a packaging within a package because it has, a, it has the jar and it has a smaller <laughs> container inside that actually contains a product. I finally did give this a try and then the product says it's good for hydrate, soften and strengthen hair. I use a different leave-in conditioner and then I use this product to style my hair. However, I don't believe I got a lot of moisture from it. So I will probably in the future combine this with a different moisturizer for my hair. However, I did get like great. This is like a been to not out. It gave me like super hold. Like I feel like this type of hold, the curls will last me throughout the week. And one of the things I also loved about this is it didn't flake. Like there's no flakes at all. So I really love that about the product. All in all, it's a great styler. I did get great definition. I also believe that at this point I have a really great styling technique. My technique has improved. So basically I can style my hair with any product and get great definition. I no longer go crazy over product. But however, I did get great hold from this product. product does say it helps to elongate I don't believe it did that to my hair but however it's not a big deal I'm fine with it and it still has like a lot of movement and I feel like I can still wear this for a couple more days and one of the things that I forgot to mention is when I first got this the smell was overwhelming and I was worried that that's gonna be one of the smells that just follows you around but it wasn't the case. When I'm going places, I don't smell it. Although it's a great smell. It's a wonderful smell, but I don't want it to follow me around. I didn't smell it in my hair wherever I went. But however, it just left my hair smelling good and I'm happy. <laughs> I'm just happy with that because I don't need it to be like my perfume of the day. Overall, it may be pricey, but it is an awesome product. As I mentioned, technique does matter too. You can't buy expensive product and expect it to do the work. You have to kind of know how to do the work and use the product as a helper. When I first did this, I thought it wasn't moisturized enough, but however, this is day four and I haven't added anything to it. And it's still decent. My hair doesn't look dry, so I guess it is doing the job. Feel free to check out all my other videos and I'll see you in the next video.